Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kinesthetic, and I'm here with you guys today with a new video. So, in today's video, I am super, 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 super excited because we are trying the Pattern Beauty Collection by Tracy Ellis Ross. By Tracy Ellis Ross. And I'm just super excited because Tracy has been someone that I have, like, looked up to and who has inspired me since, like... I started watching TV because I, I'm a huge Girlfriends fan. Comment down below and let me know how y'all feel about Girlfriends. And let me know how y'all feel about her bringing in her Girlfriends to Blackish. Because I'm super here for that collaboration. Like that, I was not expecting. But I'm here for it, okay? So Tracy has been somebody I have looked up to since I was younger. Just because I feel like, one, the way that she portrays the beauty of natural hair has just always been bomb to me. I've always looked at her and amongst most of her cast members, like she's most likely the only female on the set or in a show or in a movie who has natural hair and embraces it and just makes it look like so okay like so comforting and that was something that I struggled with for a while because I'm like growing up a lot of people had like perms and a lot of people wore weaves and to me I'm like how do I wear my natural hair and like fit in and I feel like she did a great job resembling that and just um displaying that in media you know um the second thing is that I feel like she's one of those actresses that I just feel like she is who her character is just because she brings her personality into her roles and she's just herself she's just so genuine she's always like goofy her sense of humor is always like with her and she don't change for nobody so I 100% respect that so once I found out that Tracy blessed us with the pattern of beauty I was super excited because I was like, I feel like I was low-key not expecting it, but at the same time, I'm like, why not? Like, why wouldn't she? Like, why wouldn't she? You know what I'm saying? So once I saw that she was coming out with this, I'm like, I need to get my hands on it ASAP. Like, I'm ready to spend my coin ASAP, okay? Um, so I picked up some items, and I'm going to show you guys how I like them. Do they work? Do they not? What are my honest thoughts and opinions as always? Um, so yeah, I'm super excited for this video, and I hope you guys are too. Before we get started, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Go ahead and hit that red subscribe button down below, sis, because you'll be back for more, period. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up so I know what kind of content you guys are enjoying. And, um... Yeah, at this point, we're just going to get into the video because I feel like I'm just chatting at this point. But, yeah, let's get into the video. <laughs> so, here I am. I'm starting off on dry hair. So, this is a three-day-old wash and go. And it's just time, girl. It is time to wash our hair, okay? Our hair is stiff. It's dry. It's crusty. And we don't like that. So, let's go ahead and start washing. So I'm going to go ahead and start off by rinsing my hair. I'm just going to rinse my hair just so you know. Start off with a wet base before we go in with the shampoo. And I'm going to start off by going in with the Pattern Beauty Shampoo. This claims to gently cleanse and hydrate our hair. And we need that. So let's go ahead and get into it. I went ahead and took a little bit of a lot of the shampoo. And I just lathered it in my hair. I made sure that I focused on scrubbing my scalp as well as just lathering the shampoo amongst my hair strands as well to get rid of all of the product buildup. One thing that I noticed when I was using the shampoo is that a little bit of it does go a long way. So I kind of use a little bit too much. You know, we don't want to waste any products. So just start off with a little bit and then I went ahead and rinsed it out. And this is what my hair is looking like. I wasn't too big of a fan of what my hair looked like after but we'll get into that later and now i'm gonna go in with the conditioner so this is a conditioner for coilies it claims to hydrate and moisturize our hair so i'm gonna go ahead and start off with a little bit with conditioner i usually do have to use more conditioner than shampoo so i'm starting off with this bit of conditioner and then i'm gonna keep going back just to make sure that our whole head is covered with the shampoo before we we start detangling but as you saw by my face this conditioner smells a 
amazing like it smells so good um so i'm gonna go ahead and take my pattern beauty shower brush and detangle my hair from ends to roots and just a look how easily this brush just glides this combination of the conditioner and the shower brush is just so bomb like i don't know if you guys can understand how good my hair looks how good my hair feels like look at my curls they are popping <laughs> look at it one more time slow-mo look at it popping but i went ahead and just detangle my whole head using the pattern beauty shower brush I'm, i just keep i can't stop brushing so i just had to keep going around my head and the reason i stopped was because i almost slipped and bust my ass in the shower but yeah this is how my hair is looking and i'm gonna go ahead and rinse out that conditioner now just rinse 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 and this is what my hair was looking like after i rinsed out that conditioner my curls were popping my hair was like nice and voluminous it wasn't way down now i'm gonna go in with the pattern beauty leave-in conditioner and i'm gonna start off with a little bit of a lot <laughs> and look at the consistency of it it's like not too heavy but it's still like moisturizing um but i went ahead and just parted my hair and clipped it up with our pattern beauty clip and i'm just working that product into my hair and then i'm gonna take my pattern beauty shower brush and just detangle just to get our curls popping before we create our twists so i'm just here brushing my hair and i went ahead and did a twist out off camera just because the legs were getting tired girl i could not stand up in the shower for all that time but i did come back and i wanted to show you guys how i did the twist out in the front section so i just wet my hair and then used the brush to detangle from ends to roots and y'all can see how amazing it looks even without the conditioner in my hair the brush is just so magical i went in with a little bit of the leave-in conditioner and applied it to my hair and then i went back in with the pattern beauty shower brush to you know just get our curls popping before we get those twists in and i went ahead and just did two strand twists you guys have seen me do this a million times on my channel so i'm just gonna speed this up but in that section i ended up doing three twists and this is how my head is looking after i went ahead and did my whole twist out and now i'm gonna let my hair dry and i'll be back Hey guys, so I'm back. I went ahead and dried my twist. I sat under the dryer for like two hours. I ordered Uber Eats, so if y'all see anything in my teeth, mind your business. I just finished eating. And now I'm going to take these twists out. It's currently 11.34 p.m. And your girl is tired. So I'm going to go ahead and take these twists out. And just to recap, we only use the Pattern Beauty Leave-In Conditioner to achieve this twist out so we'll see you know what it does it claims to be defining and moisturizing so we're gonna go ahead and take these twists out and see if it lives up to what it claims to do and yeah So I went ahead and took the twist out on this side of my head and look at this definition. Look at this definition guys, look at it. One more time, put it one time. And this is just like the initial takedown. I still have to like separate it and you know fluff it out and pick the roots but the definition, I am absolutely here for it. Like I was not expecting all of this but you know we're just gonna take it okay okay so i went ahead and took all of my twists out and this is how our hair is looking look at that this definition is so bomb and i know i did a video recently about doing the twist out only using a leave-in but i didn't know that this was a thing like i need to try this out with more products my hair is super defined i'm gonna go ahead and separate it a little bit where it naturally separates as i said it is 11 p.m and your girl gotta wake up for work in the morning so i don't want to open my hair up too much just because i'm gonna have this twist out in for like the next three days and i wanted to like open more along those days so i'm just gonna open it up a little bit just so y'all can see a little volume in the hair and I'll let you guys know my final thoughts and opinions on this collection and the items we used in this video. Okay, so I'm back. I went ahead and opened up my hair a little bit. And this is how it's looking. Like, I, I'm, I'm digging it. I love it. 
I think the volume is good. The definition is like, you know, it's there. Even though I went ahead and opened up my hair a bit, we still have that definition. So I'm 100% here for that. And my hair feels moisturized. Um, yeah. Comment down below and let me know what y'all think of these results. Because I was not expecting this. At first, I was like, let me try wash and go using just the leave-in because i saw um hazel goddess did it here on youtube but i had to sit back and i'm like sis i have 4b 4c type hair and i was like i'm just not gonna like do it like i'm not gonna put myself through it i'm not gonna embarrass myself and have my hair looking like a big poof ball when i have a whole week to still go okay so now we're gonna get into my final thoughts and opinions on the products that we use today Okay, so from the Pattern Beauty Collection, I ordered the Deluxe Bundle, which was $126, and the Shower Brush, which was $17. When I ordered, um, I don't know if you guys know, but the collection dropped on September 9th at, I think it was 10 a.m. It was 9 a.m. because I actually had to get to work on time. But it dropped at 9 a.m., and as soon as I got online, I was like, oh my god, I had like... A little bit of anxiety because i'm like things are gonna sell out like the way they've been promoting it the way people have been speaking about it i'm like oh my god these things are gonna sell out and also before they drop like the website with the products we really didn't know what was coming out we weren't aware of like the price of the products so it was just like you know like uh do i want to spend this much but at the same time like i've been waiting for it so i was just like let me go ahead and pull the plug because the way that the girls have been talking about it i'm like it it it, it it better be worth all this money okay um so i went ahead and bought that what i didn't know is that with the deluxe bundle it comes with the shower brush the microfiber towel and the clip so i wasn't aware of that which is why i went ahead and purchased the shower brush separately so now i have two shower brushes and y'all know what that means so a brush will be in the giveaway coming up we never know which giveaway we'll be in, so make sure you guys are watching my videos and make sure you guys are entering my giveaways in a timely manner so that y'all could possibly win y'all selves a shower brush. Um, but yeah, so my total was $157.99. Shipping was $15. I did the two-day um, air shipping just because I wanted to get it to try it out for you guys. Um, but I think the regular shipping was maybe like half that price, so maybe like $7. Um, but it did take a while for my items to ship out. I ordered on September 9th and my items didn't ship out until um, last Thursday. And then I just got them in today and I legit tried them as soon as I got them. Just because I was just so excited. I wanted to see what the hype was about. And just let you guys know what the hype is about. So that if you guys do want to purchase these items. Because I know some people hit me up like sis I'm waiting for your review. And I was hyped because I'm like damn y'all really be depending on me. Like y'all trust me but I rock with y'all and y'all rock with me. So period poo. Um, but yeah so let's go ahead and get into the review of the products that we use. So the first product that we used was the Pattern Beauty Hydration Shampoo. And this shampoo claims to gently cleanse and hydrate hair. So this shampoo was okay to me. It wasn't anything that I can see myself like purchasing again or anything that I would recommend for you guys to spurge your coins on. In general, what I would recommend is for you guys to try the travel set. That way you'll have like a small size and you can try out each product and you can see what you like, what you don't really like. And the products that you do like, you could go ahead and purchase the full size. So that's just one recommendation that I have in general. Just so you guys know, the shampoo is paraben free, free of SLS, color safe, free of cyclic silicones. The next product that we tried was a Pattern Beauty Heavy Conditioner for Coilies and this conditioner is Amplified Hydration and Nourishment. And honestly, this conditioner was my favorite product that we use in today's video. I don't usually do conditioners. If you guys are, you know, used to my channel, y'all know that I shampoo or cleanse and then I go straight into deep conditioner. I don't usually use conditioners. I don't know why. I probably just never found one that does, like, enough for me where I'm like, ooh, like conditioners you know um but this conditioner as you guys saw in like the demo before this like my hair was so soft my hair was so like manageable because my hair was so knotty before i started that video um it made it easy to like detangle so the combination of this and the brush 
listen i would definitely purchase this conditioner again i would probably get like the bigger size the next time just because i don't have like a lot of conditioners in my stash that i actually use and the fact that this conditioner worked such wonders in my hair i'm like i need the bigger size i need the one with the pump like i need the big joint the big big joint okay um, and the last product that we tried was the leave-in conditioner, which is what we use as a styler today. So this twist out was accomplished with just this leave-in conditioner. And honestly, one thing with this leave-in that I noticed, and it was kind of a mistake that I made, is a little bit goes a long way. I found that I kind of got heavy-handed when I was doing my twist. And I noticed when I was taking it down that I had a little bit of flakeation. I'm not sure if there's any like white residue, but as I am touching my hair right now, I see a little bit of it coming out. I don't think you can see anything on my hair, but I saw a little bit of it falling out. Which I'm guessing is just a result of me like being so heavy handed. So a little bit of this leave-in does go a long way. Especially if you're applying it on damp hair. Which I highly, highly, highly recommend to apply on wet or damp hair. Do not, I wouldn't recommend doing it on dry hair. Um, so yeah, I think that it did a great job defining my hair. I think it did an amazing job moisturizing my hair. My hair feels like so soft and juicy and my color is like popping so i'm absolutely in love with these results and i could definitely see myself purchasing this leave-in again so those are all of the products that we use in today's video as far as accessories so as far as like accessories that we use in today's video the first thing is a clip so as i mentioned i was not aware that the bundle that i purchased came with the clip but it was in a package so i was just like hey let me go ahead and try it out but i just feel like it's a regular clip like I feel like my butterfly clips do the same for me and you know you get those like six or eight in a pack for a dollar so I wouldn't necessarily recommend like going ahead and purchasing this clip I feel like it didn't have any special function that any of the clips I already have in my stash won't do for me um, the next thing we used was the shower brush and honestly I'm not a huge brush person but I feel like I should be especially like when it comes to like getting a perfect wash and go i just feel like a brush makes such a difference but this shower brush is so heavy duty it does a great job detangling hair which i was nervous about because i usually use my shower comb to detangle but this brush is amazing like the fact that i was detangling and i was able to feel the bristles of the brush on my roots which means that it goes safe don't interpret this in the wrong way but the brush goes deep like you can listen the y'all saw it in the demo my curls were popping but this brush i would highly recommend as i noted this brush if you want to buy it on its own is 17 dollars. so it is like comparable to other brushes that have like a huge um reputation in the natural hair community so i wouldn't say the price is necessarily too pressing but that's basically everything that i used in today's video i also have the microfiber towel which i didn't use and i also have the jojoba oil which i have i didn't use in today's video um so i do plan on trying these products out and i'll keep you guys updated on how i feel about them in future videos but that's basically it for today's video in general i think that the collection was okay the conditioner was honestly my favorite item but i just think that there are, I don't want to say so many brands, but there is such a large selection of items and products that are lower priced than these. So if I'm someone and, you know, I'm regular old Zegla Kenny from the block, um, and I, I, I just don't know. I feel like the price is a lot for natural hair products, especially in 2019, where there is such a wide range of natural hair products and selections for us curly girls. So that's my only, like, con of this collection i think the products were expensive and overall i love the results of my hair i can definitely see myself repurchasing the conditioner and the leave-in comment down below and let me know your thoughts did you guys pick up any of these products have you tried any of these products yet is your order on its way um comment down below and just let us know let's have a discussion as always so i hope you guys enjoyed this video before you guys head out make sure you guys subscribe to my channel go ahead and hit that red subscribe button down below sis because you'll be back for more and if you guys enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up so that i know and until my next video i will see you guys later